Okay, Diane, you had a question. Okay, when we're out traveling, why do men not ask for directions? And according to guy rules, if we're out somewhere and I stop and ask for directions because I don't know where I am, and the fellows I ask can't give me the right directions because they do know where I am, then according to guy rules, they get to knock me on the side of the road and leave me and take my woman. Whoa, yeah. Now that may be a little bit of a josh, but let's just explain where it came from. If we're out 4,000 years ago, and the law of the land does not cover all the land, their communities, their villages, and people know who belongs there, and they know who strangers are. So if I'm traveling through, and I'm a stranger, and I have no friends there, and nobody to support me, and nobody to back me up, and I'm lost. And I stop, and there are three fat strapping fellows by the road, and I say, hey, strangers, I'm completely lost here. Don't know where I am. Don't know anybody. Could you give me directions? And they say, well, so you don't know anybody at all. So if you were just to vanish off the face of the earth, nobody would know where you were even. And I say, yeah, that, that's, that's right. And I say, well, I know she have a good woman there. Uh, she looks, I say, yeah, she's strong. She's faithful. Work from sun up to sundown, strong hands. Stamina, she is a good woman. And I say, mighty, mighty good. Uh, you're a lucky man. And I say, and so if you would, you sure, if you would disappear, Nobody would come looking for you because they don't want to know where you were. And I said, yeah, I'm, I'm completely lost. I don't know anyone around here. And I said, well, let's pick a stone up here. Let's try this thing out. So this fella whacks me on the side of the head, and I tumble off the cart and land in the ditch. And I get left in the ditch. And uh, he takes the woman. And what we have here is a little bit of selection because my naive, trusting, ask for directions, even though it's a stranger, tendencies are not going to go into the next generation. I am not going to be one of your ancestors. My genetic and progeny stops right there in the ditch. Now, if I were cagey and slipped through this unfamiliar territory, and never let on that I didn't belong there, and never belong, let on that I didn't have friends, well, that's another story. I would have made it through okay. So there's, and I would have, might have been one of your ancestors. With my cagey, watch out, be careful who you ask for directions from, genes would have made it into our generation. So that's why we have the men rule. You don't ask for directions. And thank you very much. I hope that this is helpful and it's not going to solve the problem, but perhaps it can help women uh, understand why men are so reluctant to ask for directions. Perhaps a couple of men could listen it through and figure out why we are reluctant to ask for directions. So thank you very much.